I really tested the audio so I know it works. If I go back there, turn off the main window and... Okay, the chat should appear there. Let me see, huh? Are we join? Now, whether the chat actually appears there, I'm not sure. Because... Uh, where should it actually? Huh, it's a good question. These are the alerts. Well, it should appear somewhere. Hmm. That's problematic. Well, I'm gonna start or I'll get kicked again. So, let's see. Universal Stealth, 45 minutes. The match is already underway, of course. It's Saturday. <laughs> ah, yes, I had to disconnect the wheel, if you can believe it. Because, yeah, the wheel uh, gets disconnected when you stream. This is new. Never had this problem before. I wonder if I'm actually streaming. I don't even know. Do tell me something if I am. Yes. Perfect. <laughs> I'm off the <laughs> the runway. No no. It's on it's on uh what well, the plane is at least. Ah, if I zoom I zoom both things. The game and the chat question mark who knows who knows indeed uh, like this I go back to the game but now it's zoomed in a very annoying way well this will have to be sorted somehow uh, something very very weird has happened I tested this before starting yeah? Okay, I'm apparently zooming the desktop view of the game. No idea. Okay. Well, I don't know if the chat will actually appear there. I guess it remains to be seen. Why did I start so far away from the power? Ah, yes, I'm also stuttering. Should have expected it. It's quite annoying, really. Lately, nothing works correctly in VR. The main problem is this chat window. Because... No, but it should work, it should work. The important thing is not to scroll the wheel. The mouse wheel, I mean. Well, the trackpad. Mainly. I'm stuttering pretty badly and that's uh, that's quite problematic. But at least I'm in the air. It stutters when I open them up. Yeah. Pull the scoreboard. Or anything really. Oh! This can is here. Actually, <laughs> the entire rat uh, clan. Okay. Squadron, should I say. Yes, uh, let's try to actually achieve something since I'm already here. So if I go there, I see that I'm actually streaming or so it seems. Mm. Now if I want to scroll, I won't turn the wheel, I will just uh, scroll. And I lose control of the plane when I do. Makes sense. How do I remove the... yes. Yes. I should check whether someone is communicating with me in chat, because I'm not actually sure I would see it.
I mean, it used to appear here. But I see no chat tab in the window. Which annoys me to no end. <laughs> what a wonderful return. Well, at least I see action, yeah. It's Saturday, right? Stuttering like crazy. Well, well. Looks interesting. We can now zoom in Bart under VR. Great improvement. Attention to the designated grid zone! I wonder why it took them so long. Ooh. What am I going against, by the way? Ah, Americans plus British. And I see plenty of American tracers down there. As you can see, I'm now flying German. Which is quite a change for me. Recently unlocked the, the planes. Okay, this wasn't very well done. We can still make it work. I see a pretty hefty P-47 down there. Which I now lost track of. And we are going to try again. What's that? A target, it seems. This is good. Looking good. Okay. First one of the day. And I get the kill. Well, I know I should get the kill. No, no, it's going down. Okay, max slash. Yeah, but it's stuttering badly. Hmm. <laughs> this is fun. What's that? Another target. No, not gonna work. Ooh. Ah yes, the wheel is doing the stupid thing again. I hate you wheel. It, you can't believe it, it does it when I stream. When I stream the wheel gets disconnected and starts moving in the weird way. I should disconnect it actually, uh, completely. Uh, and, this, uh, and this crashes the game. God damn it. <laughs> Okay, well at least it didn't crash the entire VR, I guess, I guess, okay, I should have expected it. Okay, now the wheel is completely disconnected, let me see if I can find any form of chat, no, there is none, okay, well, first thing first, if only, yes, we gotta restart the game. The wheel is completely disconnected. The game is not here. Why? Ah, yes, yes. It doesn't suppose we are, of course. Of course, it doesn't. Gaijin. I will check whether my stream is actually running. Apparently, it is. Someone liked it. Hey, Christian, hi. Gaijin. Thank you. Thank you for liking the stream. Uh, my stream is actually problem. Problem is I didn't see the alert for him liking the video. Hmm. It's weird because uh, the chat should appear some form. Well, okay. Let's not dwell in this. Just rejoin. Now the wheel is disconnected, so that problem is out of the window. I guess. I guess. 
Why isn't the chat staying on top? I don't know, it is. I just didn't open the window. Let's try again, I guess. Killed by a game crash. This is very typical. Ah yeah, I can not start the engine with the wheel. The wheel is not attached. I might have other problems. Yeah, I use the wheel for some we things. No, not in this game. This game I only start the engine with it. Second attempt. Should have uh, one death. Yeah, makes sense. Stuttering is honestly pretty bad. It goes away. It goes away after a while. No, it's no longer there. But it will come back. It's so complicated to stream in VR. Like, you wouldn't believe it. It used to work now, whether it still works. We'll see. scroll it in any form unless uh, perhaps if I open the big window up there okay still scanning for possible chat messages which I don't see oh, but I might test it of course why didn't I think of that wait a sec if I go to Facebook. Yeah, let's look for Facebook on Google. <laughs> if I go on Facebook and I open and I do a test, where does it appear? Does it appear? Don't. Okay. I didn't need to think of that sooner. Mm, makes no sense. Oh, but I see action is rapidly coming my way. So let's return to the game one sec. that reason stream that's annoying <laughs> my god okay I doubt I will survive this, but let's do our part. Mm, that looks like... Yeah, isn't it an A20? Well, it's American anyway. Yeah, A20. It's not very dangerous to approach, but still, it does have a rear turret as we notice. go down honestly I don't see it coming out of that yeah it's down that was an A20 not a player so there will be others that's not an A20 ah yes it is I'm already out of cannon rounds Wow, this American. I mean, these German planes. Don't carry much ammo. 
do they? Well, I better finish the job, I guess. But where is the chart? God damn it. Ah, I know, I know. I might reset uh, the layout. It should appear. Yeah, reset the layout. No effect. Of course. <laughs> Ooh, I'm reading pretty badly actually. Yeah, doing too many things at a time. Not is getting away anyway. And A20 is quite fast. Even damaged as it is, I wonder. Now I would be greedy to chase. And also, we have more pressing matters at hand. Indeed, very pressing. What is that? Well, it's an enemy, that's what it is. Doesn't seem to care for me. That's good. Thank you, enemy. Yes, it's coming. It's coming back. Predictably. Oh, really? I don't know what he's doing. Let's go and check it out. We have captured a zone. We've captured the zone. That's good. Seems completely unaware of my existence. Where are we flying to? By the way, towards the enemy base. Since I'm getting on him, I might catch him. Hmm. What do you say? Well, if you could speak to me, which you can't. Yes. Yes. And it's gone. He wasn't a player. Any chance he never was. Acting far too stupid for that. It is stuttering, yeah. Way, way more. And he usually does. Obligatory scrolling while looking for the chat that apparently doesn't exist. You know what? I know what's happening. I'm looking at the wrong dashboard. What the hell? That's the dashboard for my blog. Yes, uh, here it is. Here it is. Nix, are you speaking to me? That's Nix. What the hell, Nix? Wait a sec. Wait a sec. Okay. I gotta zoom this thing. Wait, wait. Is someone going to kill me? I wonder. Well, it's for a good cause. Remove a column. Yeah, but not the one with Nyx. What the hell? Where are you? These are the alerts. This is... This is you. Chat is showing. Hey, Nyx. Yeah, I know you were telling me to fix the chat. Well, it was pretty... Mighty complicated. Let me see. Yes. Uh, you're not stuttering from outside. This is great, Nix. Let me see what you were telling me. Okay. Anniversary follower. Nice sound and graphic. So it's working. Yeah. <laughs> it's working. Let me see if the latest message appears. Apparently it doesn't. Yeah, it does. It does. Okay, back to the game. Remove top window. And it's doing the weird bug from before. So we gotta unzoom it. Well, I don't know what we can do actually for this. I hate you, Kaijin. Okay. It's 
Weirdly zoomed and such. No idea. The problem is, it's fucked up with my head tracking, which is very bad in VR. Uh, what the hell? I think. No, wait a sec. This is better. Yes, this is much better. Yes. So. And if I manage to get my arrow pointer there, okay, I remove the stupid pop up. And I guess we're good to go. Nixon, sorry I couldn't read your messages. Blackout is working in VR too. Yeah, it's much, much improved. This is one of the reasons I felt I need to come and stream again. Fortunately, my environment is no longer as good as it used to be, apparently. There have been some changes in my PC and many changes in uh, Steam VR and the Windows drivers and, well, a lot of things, which wasn't matters, apparently, has not stuttering pretty badly. Now, whether I'm stuttering so badly that I cannot stream, I'm trying to decide. In fact, I've been trying to decide for the last week, uh, ever since uh, I saw you coming back online, Nix, if you can believe it. But, uh, unless I test it first hand, I'll never know, so, yeah, here we are. I see targets. I see an American drug. No, I don't think I hit it. Of course, we can try again, unless he goes down already. I guess I'm trying to kill steel from this guy, but then again, everyone seems to be at the moment. Guy is still in the air. No worries, yeah. No, but uh, I'll tell you in advance, Nix, uh, uh, it's not going to be a daily team this time. This is for sure. I might do it once in a while. Yeah, I'm trying to kiss you, but I couldn't. <laughs> I guess it suits me well. What's there? No, I won't be able to do it daily this time. So, maybe. Are we carrying hobby? Well, mostly it depends from uh, the kind of performance that I can get from this. Which, weirdly enough, uh, doesn't seem to be as good as the previously was. Gotta test everything. That's a BF. <laughs> I still <laughs> mistake BF one tenth for other things. Some things never change. Yeah, I think I wrote something along the line in my description, honestly. Don't even remember. Uh, uh, but did I get the assist? No, I didn't. In fact, I got only a single kill of a player. That's another BF-110, or maybe the same one. What about this guy? Zooming in VR is great, Nix. I've been saying it all the time when I used to stream the other time. If this game had zoom in VR, it would be the best game. And in fact, now it does. That doesn't look like a BF-110. I mean, it could be, but it isn't, because it's too, it's too fat. It's too fat to be one. Yes, but I'm approaching in a dangerous way. Wait a sec. What the heck is that? Under A10? I mean, A20. I clearly see the American star. Yeah. But the A20 doesn't have the split tail, or does it? Well, I guess we'll soon get to know what the heck it is once I hopefully shoot down what amount to, in the end, a very, 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 very dangerous B25 for which I got the assist. Well, it's better than nothing, I guess. And perhaps we should go and Excellent. fix uh, our plan since it's mixing a big chunk of the wheel, of the wing, I mean. Hi, Carlo, hey. It's insane back. And you guys are too. Thank you. I was hoping for this, to find you all still watching me. This is great. Thank you, guys. So many people on in this match. I've been playing mostly in the morning, as I always are. But during the week, uh, all matches are all f empty. 
very much unlike Saturday. <laughs> yes, <laughs> thank you, I miss you too. I miss you too, eh? it's been a complicated year. As it has been for everyone, I guess. But it, it isn't over. It isn't over by any stretch of the imagination. You won't see me here every day or twice a day or anything like that. Unfortunately. Perhaps one day I might go back to that. One thing I'm sure, absolutely sure I won't do again is trying to make it big. Trying to make a big name for myself by posting on dozens of groups at the same time. Because uh, I very well understood that it doesn't work like that. It's hopeless. You cannot make it big unless you invest in your streaming. Or at least this is the feeling I have come to. So, yes, uh, a pastime, an hobby, I will stream from time to time. I hope. I mean, performance is not that terribly bad, not as much as I fear. Still not as good as it used to be. Because you know what happened, it's the stupidest thing. I actually upgraded my GPU, yeah. I got a 6800 from AMD, the XD version, and apparently it's worse than the GeForce I had before. For VR, well, I mean, when it works, it works very well. But it stutters, it stutters depending on what you do. Mostly if you add a second monitor, so... I actually came to the decision to try and stream again about uh, a month ago, but this is the time it took me to find a way to actually manage and do it. Because without a second monitor to display the chat and project it in VR, the only thing you can do, basically, is this. Meaning, there is the chat window on top of the game with a specific app which is, came, which is named something like... Uh, what's the name of the app again? Maybe if I put the... The name of the app is TurboTop, okay, and it keeps the window in front of the game. I'm also using a new overlay app, which is Desktop Plus, and I love it. It's much, much better than what I had before. It's also free. It's on Steam. If you play VR, do get it. It's great. Yeah, it's really bad, Carlo, I agree. So, so yeah, here we are. The plane is fixed, now if I can open the window again, and apparently I can, let's open them both so I'm sure I don't do anything stupid. I can close this other window, completely unnecessary, and if I go back to War Thunder and leave the plane, we can spawn in something better, I guess at last. You can actually click the window be behind the one I put on top, by simply alt-tabbing to it when you click, and yeah, it's kind of annoying. You just say it like Super Mario would have. When I click, uh, okay. I guess the Fog Wolf will do. This isn't fully upgraded, I think. I only reason to start playing Germans, finally. I know, <laughs> it's kind of weird. And yes. When I got sick, I thought I got COVID. Wow, man. Well, I'm lucky. I'm happy you aren't. That would have been quite uh, terrible, to say the least. Here in Italy, the situation isn't much improved, by the way. Starting to do the vaccines. Not for people of our age, of course. And my parents have got the vaccine. AstraZeneca, no less. Okay. Rolling. Yeah, it starts. Indeed, indeed. You can say that mix. Look at our guys, Kane. Top score in the team. Okay. The enemy has captured the zone. One, one, two, one. Okay, let's try to get another player kill. Now flying the Fock Wolf A4. I'm not sure about the differences between the A4 and the A5. They seem pretty similar to me. I also own them in Sturmovic now. Recently both of the planes, they discounted them so much it was hard to pass. Ah oh, well, it's a great plane. 
I've learned the, the strengths of the Germans recently. I had to go back uh, in memory to when we used to to fly the Americans together with Unix and you taught me about fast planes because basically I always used to turn into the enemies and yes, you don't do that with Americans or Germans especially in a Focke-Wulf when I manage to use it correctly it's truly formidable I can see that it's also quite powerful in armament, no less I wonder if you can hear the sound, the whining sound of the, the sound of the little fan that I now have here. It's good at running, but it couldn't have run a master. No, I know. I, I seem to gather that the Germans are a bit in between, uh, from Americans to more maneuverable plane. I mean, they can win a tank fight against a master or something like that. Uh, but of course, they want against uh, truly agile planes. And in turn, of course, they aren't uh, as fast as Mustang swords some such. There's a lot of action here. Well, of course, it's a full match. Yeah, it's good at rolling. The wings are small. Yeah, it's stuttering, it's stuttering. I got... Uh, I got the purple lines. Well, I used to have them when I streamed the other time too, but I have uh, quite a story with these... Uh, lines ever since getting the new GPU because uh, for a quite long time until the third or fourth driver iteration since I got it they were ever present and uh, basically it had become a sort of a fixation to me I was constantly trying to solve it any whichever way the cannon shells are deadly yeah Ah, so they are that kind of shells. You mean uh, they can explode when they get close to the enemy, like automatically? They have that kind of technology? <laughs> How is such a power learned? No, I'm just joking. But, but uh, that would be quite useful, yes. I'm not even sure what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, I knew about that. So this doesn't. No, because I remember, I think you told me about it when we were flying the Japanese, that some Japanese shells uh, do this, or maybe they exploded at a set time. Yes, the B-25 from before. I think with these cannon shells, I should be able to shoot it down easily. Well, let's try to do another pass. Completely missed the guy, <laughs> okay. Well, but he certainly cannot outrun me in that. Dangerous, not dangerous. Okay. And uh, I lost the B25. <laughs> People screaming in the background. No, 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 no. I found the B25. Well, maybe he found it. At least his gunner did. Checking the six. Not dangerous. They called it mine shorts for something. I love to Google it. This sounds very interesting. That's not the B25. That's the B25. Well, the 3D models from this game are still a bit wonky. Because no way that looks like a big plane like a B25. Until you zoom. And that's the reason zooming was this important to have in VR. Because... Ah, he's dead. Did they get the kill? Per chance. What the hell happened? Ah. Well, anyway, no idea. It's over. <laughs> what did he crash by himself? What the heck happened? <laughs> Mine short. Okay. Says one minute to the next one. We didn't have time to do really much. But. There will be occasion. So that's okay. It is working now, yes. There's a lot of wasted space here. I should... Probably I should add another column again. Let me see. Add a column. Wait, I'll maximize it. Maybe I should also put the window bigger. Okay. Make the window bigger, of course. Yes, so what we're going to need is... 
number of watchers, which apparently are Nix and perhaps Carlo. Well, now it's one. And we will put this here. Apparently, I'm no longer in the level up program, makes sense. I haven't streamed in ages. And the chat apparently disappear. It must be here. Somewhere. Yeah, you have it. And this goes up there. Yes. Save the layout. So if I minimize it again and scroll it in a way that makes sense. -na 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 -na. Will I get copyright strike from <laughs> this uh, music I want? Yes, like this. Ah, and perhaps I should save it, wait. Save, the layout already saved, okay. I save things I don't even notice. So it's like this basically, yes. But there's a bit of wasted space, I don't understand. Ah, okay. Because you gotta scroll uh, the the part that resides outside of the window. Well, okay, but it will work. Yes, it will work. It's working, actually. So, going back to War Thunder, and like this, and like this. This is my mouse pointer, these are my planes. Follow me! Too bad. What the... <laughs> I'm apparently in between the legs of a uh, bomber gunner. That's peculiar. And now he's gone. <laughs> in between the legs. Okay. Okay, what is that? I ah, yes, it's annoying that I see a useless window. Okay, and it's gone. Now, priority is to the game. You can actually print the pointer there. Now you can scroll. We will uh, fuck up the game, but this is to be expected. Of course, nothing ever works simply in VR. We come pretty close, though. I must say, I'm rather satisfied. I'm rather satisfied, I mean, of the setup. Let's see what happens. We are also playing on higher details, that's probably not helping. Spectators are worrying me a bit. I wonder if the stream is still up. Easy way to check. Well, it's not really that easy. It's going to Facebook, but maybe let's try not to crash in the meantime. Yes. Going to Facebook, checking my page. And the stream is still up, okay, go back to the play. So it doesn't crash, we came pretty close, but I know what I'm doing. Okay, back on the shadow. Basically, it stutters when you open the map, yes, and some other times. Yes, contacts. 11 o'clock. 
Hmm. I see people fighting. It produces ire. A little fun. Keeps you cool. Pretty cool. It's a uh, interesting gadget, I guess. My coming handy this summer. Okay. I guess we'll check the closer contact first. Let me see. No one dead yet. Let me see. Hmm. That's German. It's a four ten. Chase by something okay let's try to give it a hand doesn't appear to really need it uh, but we are helpful like that okay the chaser is gone got nothing on my six good kill burn up it's not a player i think well good thing but no it's a player it's a player i think yeah it's actually killed two players he cannot be a bot The other details really pay off in this kind of simple maps. When you add the shadowing of the trees, uh, the reflection on the rivers, kind of becomes uh, like a different game. It looks a bit more like Stormwick, I guess. Graphics has never been truly the strong suit of this game, but it's not that bad. Also, they removed the stupid limitations that they used to have uh, in VR, like it, it really worsened the uh, text resolution for no reason at all. You couldn't even tell how the cards really looked, uh, usually. But they improved it. The VR version has been greatly improved recently. Okay. Okay, that's an enemy, I think. Very, very aggressive enemy, coming straight on me. The hell this is stupid okay i'm not down so i guess we can still fight wish i could tell what it was by right, the speed of it i guess american yeah we're only against americans a jug looks like one now it is it's faster than me for the time being at least so it must be a jug the engine is not damaged they only throw off a little piece of the wing, which I guess is not vital. We're right above the objective right now. Moving pretty fast. A 
not as fast as the jug apparently. I'm on my tail. Now he's chasing someone else. This might play into my hands. Let me see. It's not the firing pattern from a jug. Just machine guns. What the heck? Am I being hit by the 410th turret? If I hit him, sure. Lowering my flaps a bit and. Yeah, you're mine. Yeah, it was a junk. I made a weirdly colored one. It was a junk. No, it's nothing. But I'm smoking. I'm smoking because I was hit by the Fortense turret and I have no idea. I guess it was friendly fire. There was no one on my tail. We captured the zone, that's good, but uh, I got a repair, yeah, and rearm, I guess, because these German planes are really little in the way of cannon ammo. That's annoying when the cannon is responsible for most of their damage output. Heading for the base. Train so smoke, I guess. Wasn't necessarily up to matter. We're pretty close. Yes. So now they made this new application for the phone, for smartphones that. Uh, Theoretically, it permits you to see the map. That would prove pretty handy, I guess, for streamers, because you no longer have to constantly interrupt the view by opening the map, for which people have complained before in my stream. But the problem is, how do you watch the smartphone when you're wearing a VR headset? So, perhaps not the ideal solution in my case. Still, I'd like to try it once or twice. I might rest the smartphone here on the wheel up besides I had to disconnect for this to work. <laughs> ah yeah Nix, this is an F1, this is just the F1, I just uh, started a new match, yeah. Is the G worth it by the way? I just unlocked it the other day, I still haven't rested it much. I guess the camo pattern could be useful in desert maps. But well, it's not like you can uh, camouflage yourself that much in this game, unlike Stormwork. The other day I was playing Stormwork again as well, but uh, just not as fun as this to me. It's unfortunately much slower pace. It might be more realistic, but just not as much fun. I can speak freely now since I'm not posting to groups. <laughs> Which I never will again, by the way. Far too much negativity, not worth it. Okay, I hope I won't crash into the F2. <laughs> that was quite the landing, okay. But we're still alive, so I guess it's not all bad. That wasn't very realistic, but it worked, so not complaining. And maybe if you could stop the plane, yeah. Here we are. The zoom is really great. For streaming, I think it allows you to make the view way more exciting. You can look at the details. It's great, really. Also for reading your instruments, because uh, yeah, of course, uh, VR's resolution still isn't as high as a monitor. Should try the F2. Do I have it uh, in my lineup? I'm not sure. No, I might not even uh, have it unlocked actually. So you tell me it's good. Huh? It must be. It must be. If you tell me, I'm going to unlock it eventually. Sorry. 
let's see what we can spawn now but I'll open the desktop view since we have another window in front of our thunder I don't want to risk clicking something wrong okay let me see a4 I guess or let's go with the G let's go with the G I'm actually rather interested to test it again it's new I think I won't start on the airfield uh, this currently under attack this is completely stock by the way it's a 4.0 rank ah it's the same color okay well I guess I like it uh, brown like that perhaps uh, because it resembles the Italian planes that I used to love so much who knows okay I don't know what they changed, but now when you spawn, you always spawn inside another plane. It's kind of weird. <laughs> I guess. So, like you used to tell me, it's just a ghost story, that's what War Thunder is. I'm inside some ghost. Rolling in the brown G2. It's a G2, right? Yeah. I don't know really much about this uh, particular version of the BF apart from the fact that it has an enormous air intake on the left of the engine and well that's it basically it seems pretty similar to the other versions I think I remember the G are faster right uh, and maybe the F uh, Ah, you're telling me. They have to have more cannon shells, but only 50 millimeters instead of 20. They have to, okay. I'm not speaking about what I'm flying now. This has got 200 rounds, it's not that bad. Not that bad at all. The G2 are faster, okay. <laughs> so we do have a delay. <laughs> of course we do. Of course we do. I'm not multi-streaming, by the way. I could. Probably I couldn't right now. Because if I try to multi-stream, uh, I have to use a stream lots. And if I use a stream lots, uh, what happens uh, is that the wheel gets disconnected. Yeah, but I have to disconnect the wheel anyway, so... Not that much different, Keep I guess. I won't reconnect the wheel, of course. That would crash the game, probably again. That's also annoying. The stuttering is not that bad, but the fact that I have to disconnect the wheel every time now... Well, let's just say it's not the best thing for plugs to constantly plug and then plug. Also, it's not like uh, the device is on an uh, extension cord, no, because the extension cord is going from the USB multi-plug that is here, the hub, not from the wheel. Okay, we are in the objective zone, it seems, in our beautiful stock G2 tropical pattern. Is the fuel cover blue? That's not very camouflage. <laughs> okay. No dangers, it seems. No. We're above an airfield? Yes, we are above our airfield. That's good. Just in case of emergency. <laughs> No one seems to be attacking the point. Mm -hmm. I wonder if my alerts work. I should have alerts. I should have alerts, but... Uh, the likes that I got for the video were in the beginning. When I was pointing at the wrong dashboard, so I wasn't seeing the alerts. 
I should try liking my own video Keep and see if I get an alert. Because I'm using a new method to have it now. I used to, if you remember, I used to have a lot of problems with alerts. Still, that's really, never really worked correctly for me. So now the idea is something that I've seen in a YouTube tutorials for streamers. Oh shit. Oh wait a sec. I'm going to test it later. Now is not the time. Yeah. What's that? It's a fighter. I guess it's likely to be a friend, otherwise he would have attacked me. But I'm not really sure yet. Hmm. Hey, watch out for Peter T8. I recently flew it. It had the capacity of BF-109. Ah, yes. I also love the looks of that plane. Okay, that guy is diving. Let me see. Such a peculiar plane. Unlike anything else in World War II, really. Are there other twin engine fighters? I don't think. From that era. It's also quite fast. Is it faster? Okay, it's a friend. Yeah, of course, we're flying above the airfield. These are just the airfield guardians, I guess. I should probably gain altitude here, especially against Americans. Am I overreading? Not yet. Starting to. <laughs> the lightning. What a cool plane. Eventually, if I keep, uh, I keep up to it, if I manage to keep streaming, we gotta fly Americans together again, Nix. playing other things from VR games recently too, like uh, Apex Legends, especially with a friend of mine. I might stream Apex Legends, maybe. Well, there's much more competition in that area, but like I'm saying, I'm no longer doing it to make my name big, so who cares, really. It would be just for fun. If I'm playing with my friend, we'll be speaking Italian, of course. Okay, strangely enough there don't seem to be enemies. Winner Supremacy in F4. Okay, perhaps we'll meet them there. Ah, I can test the, I can test the alert thing now. Let me see. So so to do it correctly, well to do it correctly I really should be on the ground. It's kind of dangerous because you lose control of the plane. But I guess. I like to live dangerously. Okay, so if I open the view, I'll tap it back. Uh, wait a sec, no, okay, it's correct. Mm. I also made the bottom window disappear. It's fast, but its max speed is not as good as P51, yeah. Yeah, I heard about it. It was surprising to me, really, because I originally thought it's got two engines, it must be faster. And that's not true. Oh my god, what did I do? No, still okay. Okay, so to test whether it works, I mean the alerts do, I will go to the stream, okay. remove the audio, otherwise we'll be echoing. And, well, like in the stream, let me see. Do I get an alert? Does it appear here? Ah, it's done the stupid zooming thing again. It's not that difficult to correct. Where are the alerts? Okay, this isn't working. We better take control of the plane again. Now, unzoom it. Bring it back to the chat. Yeah, I don't even see it here. Which is weird because it says. Likes should... No, wait a sec. Likes are, don't give you an alert. Shares do, apparently. Okay. So, let me try to share it. Share it? Again, I guess. Condividi. 
Can we share it? Uh, no. Well, it's kind of complicated. I guess I'll eventually find out. Now it's not a good idea. Let's return to the guy. Close the, bo the top window. Reopen the bottom window. Yeah, but the bottom window is no longer showing the chat. I should have expected it. Haha. <laughs> okay. Now it is. Now, but... Oh my god. The zooming is weird. How did I solve it? Like this. Okay. Now... <laughs> in the meantime, the plane is just flying in circles. Well, at least it's not crashing, I guess. Should be thankful. Okay, let's go to this capsule zone. Which is still up, luckily, despite my doubling around. This doubling award, I guess, if you will be, it will mean what I intended it to. A little more effort and victory will be ours. I'm a linguist, you see. Okay. not the correct way. Just its own is there. Yeah, but if uh, likes uh, don't play an alert, uh, that's not correct because I would like to know if people like my video. Uh, ah, what the hell? Maybe I could get uh, the like alerts from uh, a cell phone. I don't think they play in that case. Okay. This has proven to be a fairly boring match up to now, unlike the one before it, but there's plenty of players online. Should have some action eventually. Let's try and see what happens here, otherwise, I'll probably go to a different match. I've also been wasting time now to try and sort my problems. Well, that's combat anyway. Friendly attacking from above. Dying again and again, and yeah, I got the kill apparently. And Hurricane. Hurricanes are not very agile, are they? They don't seem to be like the other British planes. Let's keep the pressure on! Victory let's is close. keep the pressure on! Well, let's keep the pressure on, eh, even though I see no enemies. Okay. Well, but I'm looking at the time now. Yeah, well, I won't say anything for the time being. Let me see what's there. Three contacts above the river. Not they really above the river. Well, in front of it. We also captured the zone, which is good. I think I got some points from it here. Let's try to get our second kills. Second kill, of course. But there will be kills because there are two. <laughs> so it's not that wrong. Okay. One, two, three. Come on! Well, it is a fast plane, huh? 480, 490 now. Look at this. 500 going straight. Yes, it's not a little difference from the F version, it's way faster, and this is also the stock version, mind you. It's almost like, uh, it's almost like a Mustang, really. Around the 20 now. The thing that went down is an enemy, which is a shame, 
But there's plenty of things flying around, like that guy which is damaged down there. Ah, finally. Okay. Yes, you see, identifying planes in Wartanda is not really about telling them apart, but actually having the correct uh, 3D model show up. And it didn't used to when you played in VR without the zoom. Now that you can zoom uh, and the game loads the appropriate model, you can actually tell planes apart. Was kind of unfair, really. But then again, you do have some advantages to playing in VR, so I guess it balances it out. Okay, that guy is crash landing for some reason. And there's a big, big thing. That... that doesn't look... Okay. It's a goddamn Black Widow, which I should approach from below, and it's kind of working well. Oh my god, I almost crashed into my... Okay, it's already going down, I guess I didn't get even the assist. Well, okay. At least I didn't crash into the guy. Cherry, hi! Cherry, yeah, indeed. Ah, but don't get uh, too much. Uh, hopefully I won't be streaming daily now. It's just a test, really, to see whether it's still viable and for how long. It's nice to see you guys still waiting for me, though. I must say, you're really... Wonderful. What's that? The guy that I almost crashed into <laughs> while trying to shoot down <laughs> a black widow. Wow. In that short engagement I fired one quarter of all my cannon rounds, if you can believe it. So that's how pressed for ammunition we are in these goddamn German planes. You don't think about that. Eh? That's different from the American planes. Attention to the designated grid Such square. as... On me! I'm assuming VR. And you shared it. And I shared it. Okay, thank you, Nitz. Did you see anything on the stream? I cannot tell easily. No. Did an alert appear on the stream? It should have, but I'm not sure about it. Like... Uh, because I'm now trying... I'm now trying to display an actual browser window within the stream which from what I read in this tutorial that I was mentioning earlier should give you an alert of some kind for shares anyway I can now see shares in the window which I couldn't when I stopped the last time so I will be able to know when people share and thank them that's not bad not so far huh? so it's not working should have expected it really <laughs> Enemy attackers in C2. Destroy the enemy attackers in C2. Ah, okay, give me something. Come on! What a boring match. Unlike the other before it. That's the annoying thing with War Thunder. You either see full matches that are almost over, or new matches that are, are practically empty. Yeah, people are kept leaving. That's the reason. There is hardly anyone left. Now we gotta leave. We gotta change match. This is pretty boring, and we'll only get worse with time. Okay. There's a contact flying low. I'm also flying low, which is not really ideal in this kind of plane, but I guess it might work out. Well, that's not German. That's German, never mind. <laughs> Boring match! I was sure for a minute it was a P, P47. Not 47, a P38. But yeah. I was getting my hopes up, unfortunately. Nah, we gotta, we gotta change much. This is boring as well. Uh, wait a sec, there's action behind me. You should always look around before saying anything. Yeah, also because if I die in combat, we can leave earlier. 
other than go all the way back to there feels so whether I win or I lose is still a win for us in the pursuit for a better match okay I see German fire and that's our target right there I won't say what it is because of course I would get it wrong but whatever it is unless the friend crashes into me yeah should go down indeed it did it's just a p36 not even a player so that was a p36 now we know we're practically we are camping the base defendants yeah, i don't like this much else to do in this match there's a bug about several rooms too ah there's a new bug well that makes me feel at home really coming back to war thunder of course, there are bugs. I've also noticed a lot more disappearing planes, like planes that you're shooting them and suddenly you no longer see the planes, you only see the wings or the landing gear or something like that. But I mean... Ah, the Phantom Lobby. Well, the name is uh, interesting enough, I guess. It sounds like a urban legend of sort. Ooh, big target. 820, right? And something else with a white stripe on the tail that makes me think German, so let's go after the 820. As long as it's not a P25. The P25 is deadly. And longer even try to approach a P25. It always seems to end badly. <laughs> okay. And the 20 is gone, unfortunately. Yet again, not a player. Eventually we will find one, I guess. Or are they just the legendary beings at this point. <sighs> Things are chasing me. Well, a thing is. Looks like the one from before. P36. Am I wrong here? Is my assumption incorrect? Well, it looks fairly angry. My god, are we stuttering? But maybe if we Perhaps I just forgot, but uh, when streaming it always was like this. It started way more than playing alone. Pros and cons, I guess. Okay, I can turn better than this guy. Yes, I can. Yes, we can, and yes, it's going down soon enough. My god, am I stuttering? Okay. P36 indeed, and yet again. Not a player, because players apparently didn't come for this particular battle. At least there's action now. Mm -hmm. We have one turn. American big plane. It's another one of the A20 AIs, I guess wasn't at the split tail, so it's not the B-25, which would have to belong to a player, I guess. I'm approaching in a very dangerous way, but of course it's not a real player, so not as dangerous. I'm also out of cannon rounds, eventually it should go down, what the hell. Ah, well, now I'm out of machine gun rounds too. No, still got 100 ammo. Overlapping servers. You'll see names join, but you won't be able to join, of course. That's wonderful. It's the Gaijin way. I finished reading your message. Wait a sec. Let me see if. What the hell? It says I still have 100 rounds. I guess it's Phantom Ammo. No idea. Well, we might as well return to the base there. Ah, people have joined. The Rat team has joined. Well, this gets. More, more, more action in the in the battle. This is good. What up in server? You'll see names join in, but stay grayed out because you went to other plane. I mean, went to other rooms. That sounds annoying as hell. Ah, so even German guns do. Can I unjam it? Maybe. I don't know. Press R. No, no idea. If I press J, I'll just jump. 
not Anjan, so I want. All the more reason to go and resupply. I think the A20 went down anyway, because I do have one more kill. We need supremacy in B5, yeah, with gen gun it's not going to work. You know what I like to stream, if indeed uh, this test proves successful and uh, I stream again in the following days? I would like to try and stream Flight Simulator. Yeah, Flight Simulator is uh, quite unwieldy from a technological point of view, I mean. It stutters like crazy, so I don't know if it work, would work in VR. But it's amazing as a concept, the fact that you can fly wherever in the world. Well. Uh, I fiddled with it so long uh, and so laboriously and in the end I came to be able to run the Microsoft Flight Simulator in 30 frames per second, which is uh, quite low for VR, but if you can maintain it stable, it makes it playable. And, uh, well, I don't know if it will be playable while streaming, this is the main question, but it's so incredibly interesting. Oh, damn, there's a target, but I don't... I can't fire. <laughs> And uh, yeah, for example, no, you can visit the actual places from War Thunder. You can visit. I went to the CCD map, for instance. It's incredibly interesting to see the CCD of today and find the various uh, frame of references from this game within an actual map of CCD that you fly above. You fly above. Well, it's it's really cool. It's mainly been uh, it's been my mainly form of entertainment in VR in the last in the last few months. So if I actually keep streaming now, I will feel almost compelled to show it. The problem is uh, I don't know if it will run decently. That's the big question there. Click clock, click clock. Well, at least it makes a sound, I guess. Ah no, they don't even now. Now, okay, so it's for kills of AI planes, but there are still kills. I mean. They had functioning guns. They were living, breathing beings in a digital sense. I see people landing. Ah, I should slow down. I'm going 500 km per hour. My god, Nix is this thing fast. It's fast as hell. Is this faster than a Mustang? No, I guess it isn't. But uh, I think it comes close. Okay, okay, 200. It also slows down fairly quickly. So let's lower the gear already. 300 km per hour is a bit fast, but it should work. I can put my hand here and feel the rush of cold air coming from the little fan. Okay, touchdown. Still alive. Keep the pressure on. Victory is close. Victory is close. Such alluring words. Well, I guess he's a bit of an optimist, but yeah. We are in an advantage right now. Touchdown and stop. 14 seconds to reload. So we're not getting any kind of notification. That's very annoying. The concept was, you put... A browser? Well, of course, uh, I'm not getting any alerts. Uh, the browser is not there. Oh, no, wait. Huh. That's my friend that wants to play Adox. Yeah. <laughs> I'll tell him to come and say hello. I'm streaming. Stop. Yeah, yeah. Autocomplete is difficult. Uh, so streamando War Thunder. Can't say hello. Smile emoji. <laughs> you didn't notice. Okay. Yes. I'm going to respond to you later. 
Now we are kind of busy here. Yes, there's a war to fight. Leave the plane. There's a war to fight with a better plane, of course. Let's see if my friend comes and watches, watches the stream. Okay, Falk Wolf A5 this time. This is the good one. Spawning close to the objective zone, I guess. Why wouldn't I? Let's increase the fuel. I usually take off with 45 minutes. And apparently I clicked something strange because, yeah, I was seeing the news. <laughs> okay. We can take off. Starting the engine. No, wait a sec. Ooh. Oh, starting the engine. I see a spectator. Say do. Say do, Francesco. <laughs> My friend, maybe is he watching? Who knows? Let's take off. Rolling. Scan got his kill, it seems. It's nice to see not much has changed along the course of so many months. Attention to the map. Only I stopped playing. Roger that. And... We're off. I wonder if... Uh, my friend has written something to me, but I cannot see the comment. Who knows? Okay. I'll check it out later. Now I really cannot easily do it. Okay, I see contacts already, of course, because it's pretty close to the objective. Someone is diving. Someone else is trying to turn. So the rat team is in the other squad. It sounds dangerous. This is my friend. <laughs> I'm going to Facebook. Uh, it's asking me where. Yeah. Well, if not even people looking for me can find the stream, I guess it would be quite difficult to obtain visibility. But we are used to it. Okay, I'm saying okay a lot now, it's a recurring team, and I see, I briefly saw two spectators, that's exciting, more than one, but less than three. Yes, I'm flying too low, but of course I was chatting, looking at WhatsApp, I was doing so many things at a time that I made a mistake, this is kind of dangerous, especially against the rat team. No one in my behind. Didn't I have a contact in front? We have captured a zone. You captured the zone? Really? Awesome. Yes. Ah, here they are. They passed above me. Eh? He's going to die soon. Oh really? Really, they seem to be minding their own business, really. <laughs> okay, I have a contact flying low and a couple more menacing above that could be one of the enemies returning from the objective zone I don't know why he would be flying so low but then again I wouldn't know it even if he was a friend so it's not like he makes that much of a difference yeah Nick don't worry I understand uh, besides it was just a test uh, I don't think I will be playing for much longer either it was mostly a test of the new streaming setup, which has proven, I mean, not that bad. Still not as good as it used to be, unfortunately. The stuttering is uh, tolerable, 
The annoying part is having to unplug the wheel also because if you're playing a driving game, how can you unplug the goddamn wheel? <laughs> I could perhaps make it work because if I'm not wrong, the problem with the wheel presented itself uh, when I alt tapped out of the game. So if I don't, in theory. <laughs> okay, here's our combat. <laughs> Ciao, Francesco. Allora mi hai trovato? Yeah. Un giorno giocheremo anche a War Thunder insieme. Stavo dicendo prima che potremmo anche streamare Apex volendo. Perché no? Magari. È divertente. Forse sei arrivato al momento giusto. Perché fino è stata un po' una palla sta partita. A differenza di quella prima, che era un po' meglio. Però vedo movimento. Siamo in volo sulla Ruhr, il bacino industriale della Germania, verso la fine della seconda guerra mondiale. E vedo movimento sulla città di Essen. In realtà lo sto inseguendo da un po' quel tizio. Contro gli americani, noi siamo tedeschi. 5 kill, dai. Però 4 non erano giocatori. Che ne so. Magari. Ah, 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 questo è più vicino. Mm. Move after me. Move after me. Go move to the spawn. After move after me. No, you move Guide after me. me. Guide on me. Yes, move yeah. After me. Move after me. Okay, what the hell, finally, I see a lot of contacts, we have passed the front lines, now overlooking something else that apparently is not Essen, but is still a city, not marked on the map, Duisburg maybe. Now flying 423 kilometers per hour, because of course the Focke-Wolf is that horizon. That's the enemy airfield, I guess. Looking dangerous. I hear shooting, what the hell? Oh, it seems the enemy found me. Rather than the opposite. Now, what's behind me? This is not very, very encouraging at the moment. Ah, it's a Spitfire, okay, I'm dead. But there's a friend. Need backup. Let's make some smoke for him to home on my tail. Sometimes the enemy gets scared when you. Wow. Okay, this is very, very dangerous and it ended predictably bad. Yes. I hear people screaming in German. Not the best of signs. Wait a sec, I'm still alive! This is a miracle. Somebody cover me! Let's try to escape. It might actually work. Yes. What are you saying, Nix? Before I go, here's a tip for the focus. Running scissors into your enemies. Blind spot. Ah yeah. To take advantage of the rolling performance of the plane, as you were saying. Well if you can't believe it, I'm still flying. <laughs> It's kind of funny, really, because nothing important has been damaged. I was just briefly on fire. Well, what the hell? Need cover. I might as well die fighting. On me. That. Still flying pretty low. That's a target. That's a target, unaware. Let's see if I can get him. Well, to catch fire and still be able to fight is quite rare, and yes. <laughs> well, <laughs> would you guess it? I won. That's that's kind of unpredictable. Okay. Yeah, kind of awesome, really, but I was lucky. Most of all. There's still plenty of targets. Let me see, let me see. I see yellow tracers. That's an enemy, I mean. Orange tracers, of course. That's an enemy. 
diving and uh, well diving maybe a bit too much diving into the house <laughs> oops well, can you believe it this plane was on fire just two minutes ago and it's flying pretty well I will still go and repair if this were at a stream where we're looking for action most of all Bravo! What's that? That looks German. And in fact, it is. It's Bernard, the guy from the beginning of the match. That was playing pretty well. In fact, he already got four player kills. Twice as much as me. Twice as many, right? Yeah. English is a difficult language sometimes. So yeah, let's go and repair. I'm training plenty of smoke, but I'm playing smoke despite not having a leak, if you can believe it. And the engine is undamaged. So where is this com the smoke coming from? That's, that's quite the question. What a peculiar situation. Yes, time to land. <laughs> I've never been so undamaged by catching fire before. I wish more people could witness it. What's that? That looks German. Excellent. That is uh, no idea what. Attention to the map. And I guess it's time to land. Should be able to spawn the A5 now. And I guess I will. It would be a shame not to. Well, I'm looking at. Friend landing or enemy? No, no, it's a friend. Then the stripper would uh, flash otherwise. What's my speed right now? 400. Okay, we're doing a low and fast landing, but it should work. easier than slowing down a plane, it's accelerating that is difficult. Ah, it's Bernap. Looks like a fairly skilled player, to say the least. Yeah, landing gear down. And yeah, landing this slightly scorched plane, it was a bit too short. <laughs> this slightly scorched plane. That caught fire during a fight, but still came on top, so that's the power of the fuck wolf, I guess. That was quite the kill. Returning to the airfield. Yeah. Oh shit. <laughs> Scare me shitless. No, no, but it's okay, we just broke the wheels, but... We were already on the ground, so yeah, 33 seconds, and we're good to go. <laughs> Why did they have to make it? So loud. Okay. Should be spawning soon enough. So yeah. The stream should be running alright on my page. Indeed it is. I see for interaction. Thank you guys. Live. So they changed the icon for live. Okay. 
back to the game, back to the game, alt tab, closing the top window, leaving the plane, but you got alt tab back to the game because you click the window in front. And time to spawn the A5, I guess. From here. And to battle. Yeah, of course. The wheel is not connected. What a stupid problem. <laughs> okay, that's a stupid problem for flying games, but if you're playing <laughs> driving games, I don't know how you sort it. Because apparently now encoding video disconnects the wheel. How peculiar is that? And also crashes the game by the way, so that's the reason I had to disconnect it all together. The, the battle is definitely getting more interesting now with the enemy squadron that connected and well, there's way more action in general. Also my old pal scan is here so I cannot leave. The T-Rex, look at the guy, the T-Rex. <laughs> Yes, it's so fresh. My little fan here. That's my best fan of the stream. <laughs> well, actually, it's two fans. Makes a whining noise that is kind of annoying, but it, I think it should prove in handy, especially this summer. It's uh, one of these weird gadgets that you push as maybe not expecting much, but I don't know, I'm starting to like it. Also, it provides for an excuse to remove the plastic cover of the index, which as some people have discovered, it's actually a pretty stupid design because it's reflective, you see. It's a reflective piece of plastic that actually hinders the tracking. So, I had started to remove it before playing every time, so I better, it's even better like this, to just put something on its place and forget about it. from the XP something the that's the plane with the okay but I'm not going down wait a sec the XP what's the name of that plane again well it's a very dangerous plane I wonder if I'll be able to come on top again but I'm actually rather doubting it wait a sec he missed this he missed this dive but he's still in my six I don't know the turning ability of that I'm used to finding it in the Italian planes, which are very, very agile, I don't think the Fock Wolf will prove as effective. And in fact, uh, I'm half panicking, <laughs> and it shows in my maneuvering. This did surprise the enemy, I guess. Not going down yet. Holy hell, I got the XP in my tail. Okay, now he passed me. That, that might be his downfall, perhaps. But that thing is way, way more agile than me. Oh, that thing to fight in... I think he damaged my control surfaces with the first pass. I don't know, I cannot hold this goddamn plane straight. That's also lighter than me, so climbing is probably not the best the idea. I, agree. I honestly don't know how to save myself at this point. It was a short moment when perhaps I could have, but it didn't play out as I envisioned it. We're also close to the airfield. I might try to reach the airfield. <sighs> Whee! I find people flying that thing to be always the best pilots. <laughs> I come to fear that we're playing. We're so close to the airfield now. Come on. Let's try to surprise the guy. Where is the airfield? Ah, to my left. Okay. And yes, I'm not getting there anyway. So we got killed by Silver Fox 89. Who killed Silver Fox 89? 
You're killing me. Ah, oh, goddammit, I was playing the A5. Ha, that's a shame. Okay, let's go back to the BF, I guess. Follow me! Ha, <laughs> he's saying good fight. Uh, how the heck uh, do I respond? Good fight. Smile emoji. Yeah, but maybe I should say it to both teams, otherwise it's kind of useless. Since it wouldn't be raining it. What am I doing with my window now? Well, I opened a superfluous one and I also closed the necessary one. This is wonderful. Uh, let's summon it again. Edge. Yes, I use Edge for this because uh, this way it keeps the settings. Okay, we're good to go, almost. Let's spawn. That was a good fight indeed, yeah. Move it truly me. was. Yes, I cannot see the goddamn map like this. Attention to the map. People are fighting in that general area, so let's spawn there. And also, I better put uh, the chat window on top again, or it will disappear. So that's how you do it. Create a studio and click like this and click like this. Close the top window, reopen the bottom window which I mistakenly closed and yes, finally press the button on the wheel that doesn't work because I had to disconnect the wheel and yeah, well, eventually, eventually we are taking off again. Took me long Attention enough. To the grid yes, it's second, mind you. Also, I was shot down by a guy that seemed to be pretty good. No, but I was uh, messing up from the very beginning. I, I guess I'm not I familiar agree. with the Fog Wolf characteristics yet. It's not a plane I use that much. Trying to close. Okay. Check that. Hey, Francesco. Here it is. Perché no? My risposto prima. Eh, la vedo solo adesso. Mi dispiace. Perché praticamente non scorreva. Che pal. Ok, così ti dovrei poter leggere. Mi spiace, tu mi hai scritto e non ti ho risposto. Parlando di Apex, giusto, sì, tipo un'ora fa. <ride> eh beh, un po' che non stremo, eh. sto cercando di capire bene come fa a funzionare tutto. No, infatti, perché no? Può darsi che potrebbe essere divertente, parlando in italiano, ovviamente. Purtroppo non avevo visto i tuoi commenti. Però dovrei vederlo. Ok. We're off again. XP 55. That's a dangerous plane. If I ever met one. Ok. Dangers? None. We gotta climb. We're flying the quick BF again. G version. Okay, quickly approaching the enemy contacts because there's bound to be enemies among these. I 
should try to identify the XP first. Uh, that's got a very recognizable silhouette and also by far and wide margin the dangerous for here. Let me see, it would be flying high, I guess. Being a skilled player. Checking my six. This plane has horrible rear visibility. Thankfully in VR is not as much of a problem. Increasing my speed. That's not the XP. Let me see if I can tell it apart. Uh, looks German, honestly. It looks German, but we're going towards the A point, so it's correct. Mostly correct. Head for the A point. Uh, I don't have many player kills in this match. I would like to get at least another one. Let me see what we can find. Uh, that's our friendly airfield, but it's flashing right now. So, among all these contacts, and there's plenty, some are bound to be hostile. Now, the question is, of course, which. looks menacing enough flying up there like that. I guess if they were right above the airfield, the, the NTF would be firing, though. And it isn't. A little more effort and victory will be ours. Follow me! Hmm. Move on to me! Okay, it is firing now. So that's the enemy, I guess. In fact, it's being shot down by the NTF. That's not German. Attention is to it? the designated grid zone. That's not German. Someone has already shot him. Let's see if I can get him. That's that's a big plane. What the what is it? It's a big and very hardy plane. Because uh, I hit him straight on. And he doesn't seem to have taken notice. Is that the big uh, ground attack plane with the single propeller? What was its name? Hell Diver, something like that. Well, it's got a strong armor, especially considering what I shot him with. Of course, we're going for another pass. It also has a rear cannon, but apparently not a very dangerous one. Okay, it's gone. SB2C1. Okay, that doesn't tell me much. <laughs> no, remember. Excellent. I think it could have been the Hell Diver. Anyway, he wasn't a player either, so this hasn't proven a very satisfying match, I'm afraid. I mean, five kills, but they're all stupid AIs and a couple players. Still got ammo and might as well keep the hunt going. I mean, I was adding for the objective, I guess. Attention to the map. It's a lot of contacts over there. An objective of some kind. Yes. 
Hmm. That's also kind, but we do know the point A is an objective. We might as well head for it. Attention to the designated grid square. Apparently someone's putting dangers over the Somehow my UI is gone. It does happen, it does happen to the best of us. They used to trick uh, War World of Tanks players with that. They said press N for noob mod and the uh, UI was gone. And yeah, well, it's not that difficult to activate again. Of course, the old Alt A4 joke was way meaner because it made you quit the game and so on. This is the area of the objective. In fact, I see movement. Attention to the map. And actually, I'm not heading for it right now. That's the objective, which looks a bit empty. Capturing, but I should check my six more frequently. Yes, that looks like someone attacking. Look at this velocity relative to mine. It's not turning into me though. And then I guess I'm the one attacking. That doesn't mean we don't have a conflict. How does it look to you? Not very German, but of course it's a C200. It's light and common. But German indeed. Captured the zone. I captured that zone. have a couple of interesting engagements but it hasn't been the most exciting match it tends to happen when you play alone it was supposed to be mostly a test and I guess I might as well start returning to base in hopes of finding targets of opportunity wait a sec though they're calling there they're calling they're calling let me see what we can find. Cover me! Cover me, says the guy on the other side of the map. Roger that. Well, I would if I could, I guess. Let me call my location as well. I mean, join in the chat. The guy is calling though, too, from my left, quite far. No, then this is looking uh, possibly inviting, I mean, two contacts, possibly chasing one another. Maybe, just maybe, it could work. We are crossing the front lines, basically, well, they are, and running parallel to it, so they might be enemy planes returning from a strike. We're far enough from the airfield for them not to be my friends. Nothing on my back. I can't tell them zone. apart. I should probably go for the rightmost one. Or keep calling them on the other side of the map. Hmm. Come on, don't disappoint me. It's big planes. 
I can't tell that much. Probably a bomber. Nations uh, again. British and Americans. That's possibly maneuvering towards me. No, not really. Excellent. So let's go for this guy. Well done. A blending. British bomber. No, it's an egg. Ah, it's an egg. And then probably the other guy is also friendly. Very unlucky. I mean, it's not flight simulator, but the ground is detailed enough. That's a last attempt, I guess. It's getting quite late, actually, for me. As I said, it was supposed to be even shorter, yeah. It was supposed to be a test. And I guess the test is half succeeded. Even though the performance is not as good as I hoped. I can easily run this game 120 frames per second when I'm not streaming, so yeah. But it's always been like this. You want to stream, you are worse performance. Machine VR is quite annoying. Come on, let's send the stream in a blaze of glory. Returning to the airfield. A blaze of glory. It's weird because, uh, yeah, the pink stutters are in the graph, but you can't really notice them, not as much as I used to before I sorted the GPU problem. Returning to the base. So, it's almost like a, a pink stutter can be two things, all that bad or not all that bad. This is perfectly tolerable, not that bad. doesn't impair my enjoyment of the game. Not as much as not finding enemy as <laughs> so far anyway. I think we are going to find enemies soon enough. Okay, we're safe. And uh, I hope I'm engaging someone here. Yeah. Otherwise I might fall asleep. Not that far from that. Bomber's flying overhead though. It's two gas. Me. They look like Stugas. Yeah, friendly. He has an enemy that where these orange tracers are a fairly clear giveaway of Americanism. I'm not still looking good enough. First player in match. Okay, that guy is already damaged. Someone diving for him. Big twin engine, 110. That's probably the enemy, I guess. We're flying at the same altitude, hardly ideal. Mm. Maybe a jug. Yeah, it looks like a P-47. Did I get him? I think I got him, but I didn't get him enough. Let's go for another pass. Yeah, this is not as agile as my 
more familiar with John uh, Italian fire you cannot do this kind of maneuvering so I might not get the kill uh, no I certainly won't because <laughs> he crashed into my friend <laughs> what the hell today is not my day really do you have anyone okay well it, we did end in a blaze of glory albeit not in the way I hoped and I guess I'll be landing now because uh, time compels me. I mean, I closed the match third position. Wasn't that exciting, but I did get my kills. It won't last much longer, and of course we will also win. Which is not bad for earnings, at the very least. I also am flying stock planes at the moment, so XP gain will pay off as well. Attention to the designated grid zone. <laughs> There's no way to make Facebook alerts work, it seems. I will always have that problem. I wonder how other streamers do it. They just don't work for me. If that guy had shot down the enemy, at least I would have got the assist, but no, he had to crash into it. <laughs> just my luck. So, so, follow me. At least someone is having fun. Not as much as me. Okay. Not as true in my case. Maybe I should have said it because otherwise I would have said the opposite. That's a funny looking bridge. Funny looking bridge. It's not a railway bridge. You don't really notice all these details in the old graphic detail settings and here is the airfield. I'm totally off center, but this being just a video game it will work. Besides it's not like during war time they didn't land like this from time to time. Maybe just not every single time. Attention to the designated grid zone Yeah yeah. You keep attention to it. I did my part. And slowing down. What is the small cubicle on the airfield? What small cubicle? Well, that's cube-like enough. Could be a control tower, I guess. Keep it up! The victory will be ours! Now that it's a full match, of course, it's an odd one and it's practically over. It's typical from War Thunder. That's maybe the reason the game could uh, take advantage of uh, some kind of matchmaking system really it's a shame they get exciting when they're almost over and yeah like I was saying unfortunately we are currently out of time okay so to anyone who might still be watching I honestly don't think anyone is but if you were Thank you for watching my test. This was mostly a test. Let me know eventual problems that might have been present in the stream. Look at this. <laughs> okay, bye bye. Have a nice day.